That's my friend. I will pay him to kill you. Okay. You may sacrifice the next hero in your line of succession. Plus I three. Feel it. I feel it. Probably one of the best looking games I have ever played. All right, time for some nonsense to start happening. Welcome to this shelf side plays Winds of Numacera with the boys here. I'm your host, Daniel. We got ourselves Steven. That's Christian. So. That's Gudo, and we're here to kingdom build. This game's a kingdom builder. We build kingdoms in it. How to play. Winds of Numacera is an asymmetric kingdom building strategy game to become the best, most legendary kingdom led by your heroes across generations through your picked line of succession. Only one can sit at the throne at a time. By the way, this game takes place in the fantasy world of Athera, which shares the same world and characters as the acclaimed graphic novel from Dark Horse Comics. I read it and enjoyed it, but don't worry, you don't need to have read it to play and understand this game. 1. Kill 3 of your opponent's heroes. Or you can successfully attack, conquer, and hold onto 4 stronghold cards. 3. Focus on yourself by leveling to the highest rank of a skill. 4. Just do a little bit of everything to unlock these 5 cards. Got it? So first to achieve any of these 4 victory conditions wins the game. Now, here's how a turn works. Before you start anything on your turn, you check for starter turn actions. It's anything with this symbol here. Then explore, meaning drawing one card off the top of the exploration deck. These are usually helpful cards, but watch out! Some might hurt you. If an exploration card has this little reveal icon on it, you have to resolve its effect as soon as you draw it. Otherwise, you can put it in your hand. Then there are four other actions you can take. You can do as many of these as you want. One, buy. Spend some of your capital to buy slash upgrade items from the World Forge, or learn skills from a skill calling. FYI, the skills are more expensive the more you upgrade them, and if you level any skill to level 4, you win the game. Another action you can do is equip. Equip any items from your hand to your hero. They got 5 slots, remember to change your stats accordingly. 3. Trade. You can trade anything except for heroes and classes, so you can give a player some cards for a guarantee they don't attack you that turn. 4. Use. Use certain cards' abilities on some cards. Some are one-time use, others are not. Okay, and the last thing you can do on your turn is the build or attack. You get to only choose one. If you build, you get to gain capital money to buy stuff with. There's also a build tree which lets you gain new abilities. Certain abilities you unlock can get you more income. If you choose not to build, you can attack someone. There are three ways to attack. First, you can attack an opponent's hero. If you get them down to zero power, they're dead. Then choose if you want to play a battle card. These cards can give you extra capital or power, and here they can increase your attack total. Finally, roll the battle die. This will plus or minus your attack. Your opponent, the defender, will use the hero's defense stat as a foundation. They can also then choose to play a battle card and then will roll the battle die. You tally up everything and the defender takes a difference in damage to their power, which is like health. If you slay an opponent's hero, you take that hero card and add it to your kingdom. Instead of attacking your opponent's heroes, you can also attack their strongholds. This is basically the same thing, except the defender now uses the stronghold defense. If the attacker wins, they get to take the stronghold. You can also choose to attack one of the four strongholds on the map board, which are like NPCs. So yeah, that's the gist of this. Remember, you want to be the first to achieve one of these four win cons. I'm Gudo. We're gonna play Winds of Numacera. Numacera, sorry. We're gonna play Winds of Numacera. My name's Steven. I like long walks on the beach. And uh, this is probably one of my first times ever kind of approaching a game like this. Why, hello there. It is I, Daniel of Shelfside, here to play as the Numa Numa A guys in Numacera. We're the main characters, therefore I should win. Hello, my name is Christian Bernard, and I have zero experience with this type of game. <laughs> Typically, the games that I play are more uh, victory point based. I play checkers sometimes. Uh, I've played Monopoly. Yeah, I visited Portugal, commonly known as a nation in Europe, last year, August. So I visited a couple castles there, and I think that puts me as the most recent. So I'm going to go first. In this game, I'm going to play as Miron. I like cats. These are cat people, and my logic went no further than that. <laughs> I got to explore. All right, this is immediate, and I think it hurts me. Uh, if you have at least one skill card, return one, or discard two cards from your hand. All right, that's garbage. Exploration cards, what did I tell you? And I'm going to build, so I have residual income of three. Three. And I'm going to discard the most expensive equipment to gain its money. Whoa! Yeah, money. You build? Yes. Aha, uh -huh. so I get to also oh, what use now? my- Well, 
He gets one money every <laughs> yeah, time I someone get builds. Yeah, one money every time someone builds. Raiding party. I'm gonna be playing as the Sia de A. Um, what kind of attracted me was just because uh, when I saw the little character cards, saw like there were a bunch of like huge burly men, and it reminded me of me back in the day when I used to be a lot more in shape. Now I've kind of leaned out. Um, more of a personal choice more than anything, so uh, I'm happy with the way I am right now. Steven, go! Oh, it's my turn. Oh my god, I didn't even plan that far ahead. I'm gonna be starting out with Siorsa Sarai. Uh, he's the, the bald dude with the beard. I don't know if that's descriptive enough, but uh, mainly just because he starts out with a free thing. Alright, I'm gonna pull from the exploration deck. Just a random thing. Hey, what happened to Banker Adam or Dealer Adam? <laughs> a lot more thinking than I really intended on doing. Um, okay, well I'm broke right now, so I can't really do much of that. Because I'm fighting against the stereotypes you guys have of me, I'm going to build. <laughs> I'm proud of you, actually. Because we are a peace-loving nation. I'm going to do Pledge of the Viper. All battle cards that have a capital cost now cost you half. Because I am broke. And I think that should be it. Um, oh, collect residual capital. That's right. And so I get one money. And I end my turn there. All right, time for some nonsense to start happening. I'm gonna roll this dice, and then we all lose slash gain money depending on what <sighs> happens. This guy. First guy I picked was literally a dude who was just like, yeah, to start your turn, roll a die, and yeah, just nonsense happens. Money just comes out of nowhere, or people lose money. Who knows? I all right, everyone loses one money. You Except just... I gain one money, because I'm cool like that. I just gain that. <laughs> <laughs> all right, you know what, Gudo, hand me the exploration card. Just, you're close yep. to it. Yeah, thank right, you, whatever. thank you very much. All right, uh, explore time to- Oh my god, I'm in a wildfire. This thing, it's, 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 it just keeps at just I'm still drawing poorly. I'm still drawing poorly. The strategy's not going well. All right, so. X out an ongoing build block of your choosing from your build tree. Does that mean I have to... Actually, wait, whoops, I didn't erase this from last game. It, oh, I can't even physically erase my starting yeah, so, thing, so we're just gonna say no. Anyways, uh, let's see if I want to buy anything. What the hell is this crossbow? Uh, da, 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 da. So basically my strategy is uh, get a lot of money and buy skills and then win. I've been told that's how you play as these guys that I'm playing as. Just, just get the skills, win the game. Uh, I'm not gonna buy anything, uh, I can't equip anything, I can't trade anything, I mean I could trade but it doesn't do anything. Uh, or I can't even use anything, so we're just gonna go to build slash attack, and we know we're, we're gonna attack instead of building, it's kinda funny. Now, this guy, there's no zero on it, right? There's no zero. There's no, zero. So there's no difference between attacking a four and a five if I have a four attack. So we'll attack the five then, screw it. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Oh my oh, god, my really? guys, very that stupid. Is not good. Actually, there is a difference, I lose a lot of health. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, I have a four attack, goes to one. That's five, I'm already down to just four health because I'm cool like that. Oh, that's my not productive turn. Oh wait, but I got two money for attacking with my passive. <laughs> there you go. Oh, go ahead, Crystal. So I'll be playing as the Den of Vale today. It's going after the strongholds in the game, potentially more money, which is really what I want to do in the game is just get as much money as possible. When I do the explore phase, I draw two core. Uh, I'm not gonna do the hazard because that's just gonna hurt me. So, so it's gain five capital, or gain ten capital. Do I help everybody or do I hurt just me? <laughs> just for that, I'm gonna hurt just me. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> sure, dog. Okay. So I get five. What did um, I actually do? Yeah, <laughs> what, what yeah I'm very do. I, I, I didn't. Six, seven. I can buy, equip, trade, or use. Um. Um, so I'm going to, so you get your coin. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to check the box that says plus one attacking stat when attacking a stronghold. And then I get three recurring money from that turn. I got one of the purple ones. Oh. oh. A legendary pool of essence. Test of the Dutiful. You may sacrifice the next hero in your line of succession to gain the special ability. Leech. Any damage you deal in battle heals your power in the same amount. Hmm. What am I actually going to do for my turn? I didn't even look at the stronghold. Uh, fours. There's some equipment. equipment. Yeah, none of them are, are very good. You should, uh, you should build. Yeah, I think I'll buy weapon training. This one. And 
You have plus one attack against strongholds, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, what boy. Oh, God. I'm going to do oh, a favor repay to lose three power and force another player to attack a stronghold for you. If they win, you gain that stronghold. <laughs> <laughs> Any damage taken affects the forced player's hero. So you're going to attack a stronghold for me, good sir. Which one? Uh, that's a good the question. The strongest one. He gets better attack from strongholds, but also he doesn't want to attack the strongest stronghold at that point. And if he beats it, I get it. So, so I'm going down six, from five power to eight. So yeah, yeah go ahead and attack the six stronghold for me, please. Yeah, because we're way over there. Plus three, so you get it. Yeah. <laughs> nice. yeah. Going down. Do my bidding. Why couldn't I have rolled that? All right, Miron is mine. I just forced another player to liberate my own homeland. How, the, how about that? <laughs> now that's some funny lore. He fought and I got the rewards for him fighting. And the best part of all that is that if he lost, it would have hurt his champion. Because I just rolled a positive, he ended up getting the card. It was no skin off my back at the end of the day. It's gonna be... Okay, well, this is not right. screwed. I'm just gonna buy this dead man's crossbow just to deter anyone. <laughs> Preemptively, yeah. So that is four monies. I'm gonna spend them right over here. The dead man's crossbow. I don't know whether you read this. I'm gonna read it again. Um, where if your hero is slain in battle, your opponent hero loses three power. <laughs> He's a porcupine. And uh, uh, let's make things rather interesting. I'm going to attack you, Daniel. Ah, uh, okay. Uh-oh. Ah, uh, yeah, it seems funny to see that one, right? Mm, I don't like that. I spend six money and I have a card ready. Mm. Da -da -da. Are you playing a card? Uh, no, I'm not, because I can't afford it. Okay, so this is going to make all of your dice results negative. Even if oh, I hate that one. <laughs> ba -da, ba -da, da -da, da -da, da -da. Hey, I got a good roll for once. So now I have five because it's... Ah, if I get a one and I get a top... Oh, yeah, then I... Be so yeah, you have a one-third chance. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Oh, dang it. <laughs> I win. Minus two. Now All you're right. at four. You take one damage. Four. Ugh. Okay. Well, there I go. I, I'm never going to attack ever again. I've learned my lesson. I'm a reformed man. Yeah, I thought you were the builder. What happened, man? Yes. All right. Time to have more gambling happen. Let's see what goes on. Everyone gets three money. Yes. Why would you yeah, want to kill me, dude? Like, yeah, you know what? I, I regret doing that. Uh, Daniel, let's form a, an alliance. Okay. We're going to fight each other ever again. So yeah, I, I did get dissuaded from attacking more people kind of in the early game one after like that, I think two losses. <laughs> All right, well, is there any dirt cheap stuff I can buy as I'm poor after that attack? <laughs> what does this do? Well, oh wait, right, explore. I need it before I do anything. Uh. I keep trying to eyeball, so things just keep instantly happening. All right, so there's a walk of ascension going on. So I got to reveal cards until I find a maven. Uh, keep it and return all other revealed cards to the exploration deck and shuffle. Uh, I'm just gonna. Uh, I'm stealing the deck. Uh, 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 is that a maven? That is not a maven. That's a boon. This is a battle. Uh, that is a also boon. You're that's taking a, all the good cards. That's a hazard. <laughs> uh, that is a boon. Oh, oh my hey, god. Hey, maven. All right. I keep the maven. This all goes in there. Someone shuffled his deck. Hey, because I wanted to attack crew boys. It's almost shuffled his deck while I take my attack. Yeah, I don't trust these. Upon drawing, discard Famille and heal five power. Who the hell is Famille? What, what does that mean? I think Famille is the, the dude. Yeah, the card you just The dude. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah, I'm dumb. They have names. They're, these are people. Yeah, I'm sorry. Oh, man, okay. I don't see a reason to just keep Maven, so I guess I'm just healing. So discard that. Boom, I'm going back up to full health. Wow. I'm assuming I go to my cap and I'll go beyond that. Am I buying, equipping, trading, or using? I don't think I am. It's time to go build or attack. Uh, you know, it's funny. Let's attack strong again. I never learned. All right. One. Five. Five. I just have to roll positive. 50-50, right? Da, 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 da. Hey, plus nice. three. I did okay, the right, cool. I got it. All right, I got two money for attack. Okay, that's safe. And we, uh, yeah, right? Yeah. But that's the end of my turn. Money, man. Go ahead, Christian. My turn? Yeah. Right, so I'm drawing two cards. I have money now. In fact, if people attack me, how come I how, how about I sick them or sick you on them and I give you money? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm not gonna say anything. I'm a reformed man. Target player reveals their hand to you. Take one card of your choice from their hand. Oh, no. Not my uh -oh. Wait, you, uh -oh. Wait, you uh -oh. still you still got that. Uh... 
Maybe. The special, the special card. card. Yeah. I'm just gonna use this guy now. Go to go. And then I'm gonna take his uh, special essence card. I don't. Well, I forgot what it he did. Doesn't he doesn't remember what it. I don't does, remember what it, it did, anyway. but I'm gonna take it. Yeah. Okay. So I drew that pool of essence early on, and I kept it in my hand because I thought it was really underwhelming. Obviously, Christian stole it off of me. I didn't feel like that really impacted my game plan at that point. So I'm going to buy. Never loves weapon, weapon training. training. So it gives me a plus one attack. So I'm going to attack Numacera. My house! Pay two to add two to my total score when attacking. So right now I have four attack with my weapons training. I add one when I'm attacking strongholds. So five plus two, so that's seven. And I'm hoping I get a positive from this, otherwise I'm losing. I believe. Fuck. That's an egg. Nice. <laughs> okay. Oh, that's a minus one. And that's a six. Oh, so, no! so you wow. take one damage. I take one damage. Rip. So going into the game, I was a little blinded by getting all the money possible, and Numacera allowed me to get as much money possible. This, and it's not gonna kill me. <laughs> Look at this guy. His explorations don't kill right, him. We this, should kill him. This is a <laughs> This is a bounty and I'm just going to select to gain four capital. Why is he just drawing this weird colored shit all the time? What the, what is this? One, two, three, four, five. The other thing I'll do at the start of my turn is I'll place two on my home city, which is its ability. Place two capital from the World Bank on this stronghold, and you may spend this capital to buy items from the World Forge. What the, he's just getting free money from nowhere. It's not coming from nowhere, it's coming from the World Bank. It specifies. It's, uh, it's an appreciating investment that Christian won for me. I'm going to choose to build again. Which is Damn me, Steven gets money. It, yeah, Steven does get one money. <laughs> so I'm going to get five, which is my passive income now. Deal. And then I'm going to do freelance work, which gains me two more money for each skill type your neighbors have. These two gentlemen are my neighbors, and each one has one different skill. Right? Yeah. Uh, they both have weapons. Oh no, they both have weapons, weapons so it's just so one. one. You guys so all have weapons. weapons. <laughs> For some reason. We don't trust anyone. I don't trust two, like that. Yeah. <laughs> That's the entirety of my turn. All right, I'm gonna draw an explore card. I blessed be upon you a cool thing. Uh, ooh, this does look pretty cool. Mm, I'm pretty good at this. I was about to read it, but then I realized I'm not playing it. <laughs> Um, I'm just gonna look at these. Maybe it might be worth attacking one of these just for the monies. I was attacking these with four. You can do it with six. Come on. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. All right, fine. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> I'm gonna attack this thing. Yeah. Your um, hometown, actually. What? Oh, it is. Yes. Yeah, dang. I need it. Okay. <laughs> I need my hometown. So, I, yeah, I do need my hometown. That is usually a thing that is. Cool and nice to have. Power of seven. Well, that's a big number. All right, only positives, only positives. Ugh. That's a failure. You take this one is, damage. This Man. is awful. This is pretty stinky. Can I start gambling now? Yeah, I guess so. Give me the dice. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, See, I'll get you money. Just you wait. Okay. Okay, well, I, I, everyone loses three Damn money. It. I get three money. I, I am uh, so I am sorry. Bro. Do I just pay one? Okay. Okay, I pick you for this, all right? So I choose another player. Okay. So we both get capital, and the amount is equal to my guy's defense. So you get two, I get two. No, it's, it says respective heroes' defense. So your respective. respective. Your respective heroes. Uh, oh, okay, okay. This is a... So you still get two, you get one. This is no good. Yeah. What the... F okay, well, is... I, I tried to give you money. Apparently my guy is just an <laughs> asshole. Uh, yeah, so that was my start of turn nonsense. Exploration time. <laughs> What the hell? I keep trying to eyeballs. All right, clear skies. Gain four capital, and all players must build during their respective turns until it is your turn again. Well, I was gonna attack. Sounds like I'm building. <laughs> Wait, so we're all building until your turn next? Apparently. Yeah. Oh, okay. Makes things easy. Building right, a century. Fair all right, sure. time to build. Or actually, I want to buy something before I build. Uh, right. That's what I'm supposed to be doing. <laughs> Wait, so that's just attack. Is one for defense somewhere? Because no one can attack, I don't see a reason to buy things right now until it's my turn again. So I'm actually just not gonna buy anything funny enough. Alright, so it's building time. We're gonna I don't know, take a passive 
where I fucking just can spend five money to take the build action after attacking. Uh, and then as my residual capital, that is four plus two, so six money. All right, go ahead, Christian. Exploration card. Exp Everyone must attack. Wow. Oh, <laughs> fun. Good night's sleep. You heal three power. All other players heal sleep. one power. Yeah, heal. Wait, all of the players heal one power. Oh, all right, cool. I like You're that. You're doing it? Yeah. Awesome. All right. Thank you. See people. Good night's sleep. Very important. All right. I'm going to go uh, siege strategy. Gain one capital for every face down in the independent stronghold. So I think there's only four here. So I just get four. I'm going yes. to take the two clean. coins for my stronghold here and then explore. All right. Freelance tactician. You may pay two capital to reveal cards from the top until you find two battle cards and keep those. I'm actually going to do that. Yeah. It's a lot of hurting not, cards. Not, that's about <clears throat> Since I'm forced to uh, build, it's actually in my best interest to go get uh, agriculture training right then, just to boost my income. This is now plus four. Steven, go ahead and get your one for your yes. passive ability. And then I can actually activate this one for self-sufficiency now, because I have two, I have training in two different skills. Whenever you attack, battle cards cost half as much capital. Hell like yeah, mine. Brother, which will be really fun when I get like to attack. attack guy, I guess. <laughs> Because after you build, if you have ticked at least four build That's twice. Four. <coughs> okay, let's go. Um, uh, explore. We shove Zumet. That is not a sentence, that's a man's name. Um, upon drawing, discard, we shove and heal five power or accept we shove into your inner circle and gain a special ability. One time use. You can build and attack at the same turn. Oh. Whoa, Nelly. Okay, he's yeah, he's he's coming with me. Yeah, I can I can probably buy stuff, right? Mm. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. Want money? I would like money, yes. But uh, I don't what really. You want? I don't know. I don't know what I want to really <laughs> buy. Well, I'll give you something if you know what you want, because I can't just freeform give you money. I have to do it right now. So you kind of have to do some accounting on your end, buddy. I don't know what you have. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean that's a. Uh, for now, I think I'll just forego the trading and just go straight into building. I'm just gonna do forge and gain one, uh, so I'm gonna mark this down right over here. Gain one capital for every battle card in the discard pile. Okay, I'm currently one-handed because I have, a, I have a butter hand. There are Count. four battle cards in the discard pile. You're That's pretty gamer. Please don't take away my money, Daniel. I'll try not to, but the dice, there it's, it's a shitter sometimes, what can I say? Understand. I'll pick you every time for the fortress, though. Or stronghold. <laughs> Thank you, baby. All right. I think that's it for me for now. Okie dokie. Gambling time. So we're getting rid of this thing. We right? are now, yes. Uh, Get out of here! Goodness. All right. Hopefully, everyone gets money this time because I don't like to be that guy. Uh, okay, that, so everyone loses too. I got. I'm trying to get people money. You're that guy. Mm. Asshole. Oh, Anthony is a funny guy. I think I end up stealing way more money from people than he actually end up giving. He's just a goofy lad. Yeah. Um, <laughs> see, I'm over here giving people health, and you're just. Taking All right. Well, I picked Steven for my effect for the stronghold, so because well, we clarified that is. It, yeah. So Truck, I get two, yeah. you get one. I wish I can. I wish you can get two from me, but you know, Christian here <laughs> <laughs> clarified the rules like he should. But God damn it, I hate him for that. Explore time. Give me some nonsense. Woo. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Wait, did I pull an explore card? You did. Is this? Yeah, it's Oh yes. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm getting old. All right, time to buy some stuff. If I buy a thing here, does it instantly refresh? Oh, so it's, okay, so let's push our luck. Let's six, just buy that, why not? Dang, I was hoping to just get a bunch of swords. Ooh. Blessed chain. Oh, All right, well, All right, that's cool. I'm gonna spend 10 and get myself the weapons training because that's what I was doing, apparently. <laughs> I'm going to attack a fortress now because, you know, no one wants to trade, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. How come we have six attack? You went from four to six. Because this gives one, this gives one. Okay. Just one clarification. <laughs> yeah, this is a blessed blade. It gives one on default. I don't know, that equipment I got was pretty good. Six for a plus one is a lot better for the skill for 10 for plus one, so. Just saying. That one is money, is the, that one's healing money, and this one's money that is defense. Whatever, we get the best one, screw it. All right, so I have six. I'm not gonna play a card. 
Ba da ba 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 da 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 I have an ability where it says after you win a battle where you're the attack, you may pay five to take the build action. So, uh, yeah, don't mind if I do. I will pay five and build my bountiful empire, which I'm only allowed to do when I have two strongholds. I gain ten capital and everyone else gains two capital. See, I'm the money guy. But also, since this is a build, you get another money, right? Mm. Oh, mm. 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 See, I look out for you. Okay. Oh wait, I forgot. Since I have two strongholds, that also means I get the the air. Yeah, it just, he's, he's there now. I don't. Where did I put him? Legend up there. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's a pretty nice turn. Yeah, go ahead, uh, Christian. Okay, so I'm gonna do the two exploration cards. Uh, I have the same attack as you. You have more attack like have, stuff. I've than had I do. bad luck, bad rolls. <laughs> Cole allows me to uh, keep him in my inner circle, and then at a point later in the game, I can try to retreat when the battle begins, or I can discard him now and get five capital, and that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> so I'm just gonna get five. <laughs> All right. Uh, and then I'm just gonna discard Zeal. So I'm gonna do a couple things. First thing is I'm gonna sacrifice the next person in line of my line He's of doing succession. It. Oh He's doing goodness. it. Just my tribute see. summoned this dork to get that dork out. <laughs> just to see what that's like. Killed one of his nerds. To, get a new nerd. to give this nerd vampirism. Yeah. Basically, yeah. Um, and then I'm going to go to the attack phase. And now I'm going to play my battle card. Are you attacking a person or a stronghold? I'm attacking a stronghold. Okay, okay. So I'm going to go after Numacera here. Ah! Wow. Um, so divine intervention, <sighs> omit your battle roll and resolve the battle as you would. Three battle rolls, so that gives me eight. And then I get... He actually got Numacera. the big one, my god. Big one. And so with that, that gives me eight coin. Off the jump. Now he's gaining. I take it back. He actually is a stronghold guy. And capital goes from two to four. Score of eight. And this had a score of seven. There's a one difference. My god, that vampire's wow. coming in hot. Big fan of the Pool of Essence card. Discovered in the game that it. Uh, stacked well with a lot of my other battle cards uh, because it dealt damage, gained that health back, so it really was a net zero for me in that sense. That was a that was a turn. That was a turn. All right, I'm gonna start with the uh, Iran accumulation. She's getting before. money from nowhere again. Yeah, I drew another special purple card, but um, I'm just gonna keep it in hand actually. Oh, purchase. Uh, Defense training. There we go. So that's 10. Do that. It's going to give me Rogue. Because I have at least one level and three different skill types. So yeah, man, let's rogue. go. So these guys say that they're pretty good at a legend strategy, which I think is kind of a bit of a jack of all trades since you have to do a little bit of everything in order to unlock different classes. I'm largely gonna try that, but you know, I think the key is to stay flexible, be adaptable, since getting all the classes involves doing a little bit of everything. I'm going to attack. Even as the lowest defense, I'm gonna go after you actually. What the okay. f That's my friend. I will pay him to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I have a base. Attack of three. I have weapons training, and you have one equipment, so I get plus one for that. Remember, if you kill him, you take three damage. That, that's fine. <laughs> that's fine. Mm. Okay, fine. Yeah, you know what? Oh, he's just balling. Uh, or wait, huh? Yeah, yeah. No, okay. I'm, just, I'm just, I'm doing it. Rip. All right. Um. Oh. Uh, let me. So I got one. Let me roll first. You know that negative might come up now. <laughs> uh, well. All right, well, let's see it. Come on! Minus one. So this is your zero. defense. All right, do it. Plus two. Girl just kills you outright. That's seven damage. It It is. It's been nice knowing you, Kratos. No! <laughs> oh, but you take, you take uh, three, damage. three damage. Three? Yeah. All right, so down to uh, five power. I'll be honest, I didn't think I was actually gonna kill Steven's hero. That was just kind of a neat bonus, but I'll take it. Yes, Kratos has had a hot luck mounted on a wall now. <laughs> I have slain a hero. Oh man, this guy sucks. I didn't think I would actually 
kill him straight to death. <laughs> All right, to be I, I've been having awful luck this game. Why are we not just attacking people um, instead of strongholds? What the fuck? Yeah, so I, uh, that unlocks the tyrant for me. Which, by the way, I only attacked him with the low defense because the condition on the tyrant is you have to win. You don't have to kill the the dude. So that was a bonus. Yeah, yeah. we should kill him. <laughs> I, I will fund this happily. Yeah. Do you have Gudo? Five. Five. We can kill him. What's his defense? Oh wait, um, you can kill him. You just have to do just. Uh, yeah, I, I oh, wait. I, I equip this. No, it's one. <laughs> just kill him. Oh wait, I since I still have the weapons training, does it still training carries over? Carries over. Okay, so I have four attack. That is good, I guess. All right, I'm gonna explore. Does your hero I do anything? Huh? Does your hero do Whenever you win a battle, a thing happens. So whatever. Against a hero, you steal capital. Against a you know. hero, oh, you know he's gonna be attacked. <laughs> So, I swear if it's another battle card. Oh, wonderful. I thought you want battle cards. What? Hot Springs. <laughs> While journeying through the freezing north mountains of the Great White North, you chance upon a natural hot spring pool. As you bathe yourself in sulfurous waters, you find yourself feeling replenished and spry. Roll the battle die and heal that much power. It treats all numbers as positive. Wow, that's very useful. Woo! I'm just gonna discard this. <laughs> no hot springs around here. We're all about murder instead of relaxing. Get out of here. <laughs> Get out of here, Uncle Iroh. We okay. can relax There's... when they're all dead. Okay, so I'm going to equip a uh, dude man with the crossbow, but this time we'll have it in his left hand. Maybe that will be more of my case. <laughs> Obviously, that was the problem. Yeah. <laughs> my mistake. I need to look at these. I don't remember. So. Uh, residual capital from every hero slain in the game. Because I was just like, it doesn't give attack, I don't care. <laughs> sure, I got the money. I'll buy that. Brain and Way more here. thinking than I intended with this character. I don't know about you, but I'm Thunkin. <laughs> Thunkin. I can just give you money. You sure? I want you to attack Udo. What the hell? He's the guy who's good at attacking. So I was like, I don't want him attacking me, so let's just have him attack other people. I'll pay him to deal. Like, it, I think it's a worthwhile investment to pay money to see if he doesn't attack me. Like, that just seems like a good idea. Probably should have... Taking more help from uh, from Daniel, the sugar daddy, but unfortunately, my ego was just up high, and I was like, "Nah, I'm not. I'm not. I don't need that. I need that." You like giving me money for? How much do you want? Just four. Four? Here you go. Actually, take five. I'm too lazy to count. <laughs> wow. Okay. Um, I'm just gonna buy this blessed mail. Bless up. My only uh, like stipulation to this deal is attack Gudu at some point in the future. So it's a very just loose binding thing. <laughs> At some point in the future. <laughs> okay, just attack him at least uh, once this game, you know? That's actually pretty good. Oh, wait, I should probably up update my uh, defense stats. <laughs> up dick my defense up dick. <laughs> up, Not update, not up... Did I say up dick? <laughs> <laughs> okay, as I said, I'm gonna use Weesaw Zumet's ability. I guess he building just... Building and attacking. Yeah, yeah, building and attacking. Got it, continue your turn. Wait, 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 no, I... I... I misread something. Never mind, never mind. Do you need more money? No, 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 no. <laughs> more money. I, I, I was gonna do one of these things, but then I realized that uh, I wouldn't be able to. So I take it back. I'm just gonna be attacking. And attacking Gudo, I will be. Okay. Woo! I love funding proxy wars. You have a shit ton of attack, don't you? Not really, Not I really. only four. Or he wrote five in there. Hmm? Oh, wait, wait, no, 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 I am using cell swords, uh, where I have a group of mercenaries help me in this battle. Ten cost, uh, my god. Uh, but, but, because I have a uh, Pledge of the Viper. Um, cut in half. Cards are cut in half, so oh my god. Five. These cell swords are working for cheap. Um, if I deal any damage to my opponent, double it. <laughs> Woo! Oh. <laughs> He's going for the kill. And, if, you, and if I end up somehow shooting myself in the foot, then I uh, have yeah, What the, if you do damage to yourself? Uh, then I half the uh, the amount that I lose. All oh, right. okay. Plus three. All right, so you're looking against the. Oh God! <laughs> don't roll negative. Don't roll negative. Don't roll negative. 
go. You can roll plus May three. May the odds be never in your favor. It's going to be a minus three. Plus I can three! Feel <laughs> I can feel it. Plus three. Okay, plus three. See, I blessed okay. it. See, I'm yeah. the best benefactor. Thank you, thank you. Three damage. No, six, six damage. Six damage to me, and I die. Woo! Horrible damage. Okay, so Steven just killed off my first hero, Jorma Shungra. That might seem like it helps him a lot, and it hurts me, but actually, this reveals a way for me to win on my turn as soon as it gets back to me. This is how. My next hero in line of succession is Ekram Vidal. I need two equipments on him in order to earn He's already accumulated a, a, a nice chunk of cash. That, that'll give me the Paladin with uh, Ekram that I just revealed. And then, you know, I'm all set. So what could possibly go wrong? Hooray, I finally did something. And then sure. you get a thing, right? You steal money from Oh, Gudo. yes, I Gudo. steal money from Gudo. Okay. Yeah, you have half the money. power they lost. So Gudo lost how much power from that? He lost all Five? of his, He lost all of his health. Half of that rounded up, so you give him three. Yeah, yeah. Money, money, no. Yes, I'm only one third the way done, baby. Change. Yeah, you oh, two, yeah. whoops. Not no, 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 no. Sorry, I'm, 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 I've been, I've been kind of out of it this entire game. Don't worry, Good has been embezzling too, because he pulls money from nowhere. <laughs> All right. So do you. One third the way done. I can already smell victory from here. All right, see so your turn, Daniel. Okay, I'm going to gamble now. Yeah. Wee! I get one money and so does everyone else. Yes! Here you go. Uh, Gobless. And Gobless. then I get an additional two money because of my thingy-mabob of the whatever this is called. Perth? Yeah. And then you get three money. Yeah! Mm-hmm. 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 Uh, yeah, and I'm just gonna go uh, also put one money on this because this has a start of turn thing where I don't, I don't even know what that does. It just gets it, but whatever. I'm gonna go straight to attacking now. Uh, I'm gonna attack this. And because that's a three and I have a six, I'm not even gonna roll it as guaranteed for me unless there's like some rule about negative three being like, I don't feel, but I don't think it is. So, okay. boom, I get that. Wow. wow. And then because I win a fight when I'm the attacker, I pay five and I take the build action. And for my build action, I take tax collection, and I pay okay. double an independent stronghold's defense stat in capital. I'll just buy whatever. There's some fives there, sure. I pay a ten. I just take this one. I have four strongholds. Oh. Party! That was. That was okay. okay. I did not. And then I give all of my money to Steven. Uh, okay. Oh, okay, he already had everything set up from the beginning. Game was fun. Uh, I did not do as well as I anticipated. It doesn't surprise me in the slightest that he spotted the pathway to victory by, you know, attacking this stronghold, which procs this one tech that lets him just purchase a stronghold because he has a lot of money because he's the economy guy because he gets a lot of money. I didn't know Gudo was one turn away from winning. I was just like, well, he looks like he's doing well, so Steven, sick him. Hey guys, Ashton here. So if this looks like something you're interested in, check out the description to sign up for the email list to get more informed about the wins of new Masera Kickstarter. You also get access to their bonus limited edition mini expansion. Woohoo! Also guys, if you just want to grab the graphic novel, the one that I read and enjoyed, that is out now. So I'll leave a link for it below. Thank you all for watching this shelf side plays of Winds of New Masera. Don't forget to a like and a comment. And if you are a real G who wants to support us even further, we got a Patreon and YouTube memberships. See ya.